Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome to Carpo Gaming and another Monster Hunter World Iceborne video. Resident Evil has returned to Monster Hunter World. <laughs> we have a new collaboration event, Return of the Vile Weapon, available until December the 5th, 2019. And with this event, we can have two Laird armors there, Leon and Claire from Resident Evil. Now, in order to get this Laird armor set, you need to head on over to events and select the Return of the Bio Weapon mission. Now, this is a five-star mastery rank mission, and it shouldn't be too hard to complete. You're going against a different version of Val Hazak. This one is a zombie fight version. So when you get that influential hit that normally gives you a defense down, you're going to be turned into a zombie, which is pretty freaking cool. I'm not going to spoil all of the different effects that comes with that. But once you defeat this guy, you will then receive some very unique rewards. That's right, we are talking about these coins. They're not ace coins, they are stars badges. Now you're going to need a total of six of these in order to get your land armor set. So let's head back over to the city and see what we need. We need six of these star badges. We need pure blood, Val, Hazak, Flail Wing, and our Shadow Wings. And we need some Death Weaver Membranes. So there you have it. We need $80,000 to complete the transaction with the Smithy and we can get ourselves some new Resident Evil layered armor sets which are pretty cool but it doesn't stop there we can actually upgrade these layered armor sets making them viable in the end game which is pretty freaking cool now what exactly makes these layered armor sets special well at two pieces we get zombie and that fluvial resistance and at four pieces we get the agitator secret which is going to boost up that agitator skill all the way up to seven so that is pretty freaking cool we're going to get some pretty freaking amazing numbers because we're going to get a ton of damage we got six on the boost we got weakness exploit level two and spread power shots not bad not bad at all well how does this actually perform and is it worth your time and our materials well, we're about to find out right now. As you can see, with the agitator perk, it is absolutely amazing. You're gonna get some pretty freaking good numbers with this set. So if you're looking for high damage builds, you can definitely use this to your advantage. Definitely worth the time, definitely worth the materials to get this layered armor set. Now, once you have completed that, don't forget to head back over to your housekeeping because there, once you complete it, you will actually give you two different items. These items are pretty freaking cool. That's right, you're going to get two new gestures. We got the Raccoon City Zombify and the Zombie Bite, both which are pretty freaking cool. Now, this is what it actually looks like. <laughs> you bite yourself, basically. You can turn yourself into a zombie and you can unzombify yourself with both of these unique little gestures pretty freaking cool so yeah ladies and gentlemen that's pretty much going to end it for the video as always if you are new to the channel welcome don't forget to subscribe and if you really want to help out the channel and the video you can do so by liking the video if you indeed like the video once again thank you everybody for all your love and your support and as always i'll be seeing y'all in the next one later